Hi guys, welcome back to Finpact. Today I'm gonna to be going to why I am super duper bullish on VeChain and how I think it is going to revolutionize the crypto industry forever and why I think it will be a fantastic investment to hold for the long term. And before we begin guys, go smash that like button down below. Let's push this video out so more people who can't normally see my videos get to see this video. And if you haven't already subscribed, go hit that subscribe button down below and that bell notification to get informed when I post a video as it's a lot of time sensitive information. And I have a link down below for Webull where you can get two free stocks when you sign up and deposit your first $100. And those two free stocks can be worth up to $1,600, which is a fantastic deal in my opinion. So for a bit of background, VeChain provides blockchain solutions for businesses around the globe and it harnesses the power of the VeChain Thor blockchain. And VeChain has an advantage in emerging markets. It has deep ties in the Chinese industry and government and this can help VeChain have a real competitive advantage for price rallies in the future, especially given we saw the market crash around May 19th and May 21st and one of the crashes was fueled by the fact that the Chinese government had banned financial services providing crypto related services and many people have been speculating that China might be coming out with its own digital currency. Since VeChain has ties with China, could it be possible that China uses VeChain's blockchain technology for their own digital asset? Now could this happen? Well we don't know yet but the fact that VeChain has strong ties with China, this could be an advantage for VeChain's price rallies in the future. Maybe it may not be subject to certain market corrections in the VeChain price especially in relation to any FUD news from China. The ties with China might be an advantage for VeChain's competitive advantage and it might help VeChain stay more resilient when there is a market crash, especially one that is more in relation to Chinese news that could be more FUD and that could cause usually the price to crash but maybe we see the price will not crash as much if we have VeChain involved with China and giving its services with regards to the VeChain's blockchain which is the VeChain Thor blockchain. So VeChain was introduced in 2015 as part of Shanghai based blockchain as a service company, BitC. And VeChain is a distributed business ecosystem that leverages blockchain technology. It's specifically designed to be used by both small and big businesses. The VeChain Foundation is founded in Singapore and oversees the development, governance and advancement of the VeChain ecosystem. I believe that VeChain is a mature company that is not based only on speculation. Of course, an element of the whole crypto market is based on speculation because people will believe that the price will go up because a certain coin or blockchain technology offers a real life solution in the future. But VeChain's real life solution has already been implemented. The VeChain 2.0 white paper actually says that the solutions proposed by VeChain are not just theoretical. They are solutions tested and discussed with over 700 enterprises and have been implemented for over 100 plus fortune level enterprises. So VeChain has two separate tokens, VET which is the VeChain token and VTHO which is the VThor token. So the VeChain token is used for financial transactions on the VeChain Thor blockchain and VTHO which is the VThor token and that is the energy token and that's used to conduct transactions on the VeChain Thor blockchain. So basically VeChain token owners can generate VThor tokens for use on the VeChain Thor blockchain. Now on the VeChain white paper 2.0 we can see some of their use cases in this diagram. The first one is that it can be the internet of things, tagging the physical products collecting important data in an automated manner, such as temperature, humidity, acceleration, and securing identities. A use case in the real world for this would be something like food safety, as the VeChain enable Internet of Things device can be deployed across the supply chain. That can be used on products, vehicles, warehouses, then environmental and location-based data from these devices can be uploaded, verified, and stored in a tamper-proof decentralized manner on the VeChain Thor blockchain. So solutions like this have already been implemented by several companies such as this one. I won't pronounce it, I might say it wrong. <laughs> and adding on to this, this is anti-counterfeiting. The counterfeiting in the luxury goods market is a serious problem and by attaching an encrypted chip and then using the chip to log and trace logistics, warehousing, maintenance and resale, owners can be assured of its authenticity. This has been used for luxury wine tracing for I won't say this, I'll probably say the spelling, I'll probably butcher the pronunciation and in testing for the Renault luxury vehicle components. 
So this can really help develop supply chain management by assigning and tagging specific physical products and recording it in the blockchain. So the second thing that VeChain can offer is the VeChain toolchain, which is the data blockchain as a service layer encompassing all necessary components to make the Internet of Things and blockchain integration frictionless for non-blockchain savvy enterprises. This essentially helps integrate the Internet of Things with the VThor blockchain and it helps this integration become more seamless and frictionless for people that are not that aware of the blockchain technology behind it. And I've already mentioned, but we have the main fundamental offering, which is the blockchain, the VeChain Thor public blockchain. And this is their underlying protocol, which enables immutable ledger and free value transfer. So this is the main blockchain core. That is what holds VeChain. And that's what the main foundation and fundamentals behind VeChain are built on. And this blockchain brings all these other components together. All these components are all built based on the fact that there is the VeChain Thor public blockchain. And VeChain has part partnered with world-renowned consulting agencies such as PwC, DNV, GL, Deloitte, Cointelegraph Consulting to build solutions directly addressing business pain points. So these consulting companies would have the know-how of cost management for companies, how strategy can be improved, how a company can be more profitable and where the problems are and where the solutions are. And they would help build a synopsis where VeChain can come in and help streamline these companies, improve their logistics, their management, their strategy, and help improve how these businesses can execute their goals through the blockchain technology that VeChain offers. VeChain offers so many layer solutions. If we look at this graph, it has an interesting Internet of Things layer, it has the VeChain Thor blockchain uh, part of it. Then they have the infrastructure layer that helps facilitate the uh, blockchain from operating smoothly. And they also have the application and service layer, which is how it can help be implemented in the real world, how people can use it more easily, even when they don't know the technicalities behind it. So all that sort of support is there. They have a VeChain Thor mobile wallet. They have different ecosystem applications. And there's lots to VeChain and they are constantly expanding and what is really quite reassuring is when you look at their list of partners so there's a website called VeChain Insider and here they talk about everything to do with VeChain they have a complete list of the VeChain partnerships yes this article is from August 2018 but I can see that they have updated it for things like what the new partners that have come in so I think it was last updated in 2020 however it's super reassuring seeing that their strategic partners involve DNV, PwC, National Research Consulting Center, Yida China Holdings, BitOcean then they have other partnerships with huge names like BMW Group, there's Walmart China there are so many companies that they have on here with partnerships which I'm sorry but let's be honest when you have so many renowned companies partnering with a blockchain technology company like VeChain that has its own tokens then of course it's inevitable to see great price rallies and I believe that the fundamentals behind VeChain will definitely help see it through to a price rally now in this bull run this can only be possible if we see Bitcoin and Ethereum and the other major altcoins break past their previous all-time highs however I do believe that we will definitely see some huge returns in the next bull run so I think that will be around 2024 2025 when the next bitcoin halving takes place and we see huge price rallies to crazy levels that people are predicting but i don't think those levels we will see in this bull run my price prediction for VeChain in the long term is that we will definitely surpass the all-time high we saw this year at around 0.22. And if we see Bitcoin in the next bull run, at least 4x, 5x, what it currently is at, then definitely we will see at least a $1 VeChain. We will see it have a few corrections for sure along the way, but a $1 VeChain in the next bull run is definitely possible. I don't know about $10 or anything like that. That will probably depend on... Bitcoin and Ethereum and where they are at. So we have to see what happens in this bull run, but I'm really bullish on VeChain. I personally hold VeChain. However, I just have to also say that none of this is financial advice. This is just my personal opinion. I believe in the fundamentals behind VeChain. I think the price looks incredibly solid and we are actually trading at such a good price right now. It's such a discount compared to the previous all-time high. And if this bull run is not over, then I definitely think we will see VeChain at least go past its previous all-time high. But that will all depend on the current state of the bull run in the crypto market. I just also want to add that the VeChain management team is fantastic. It's known to be very business savvy and tech savvy. We have actually the founder, the 
CEO and co-founder Sonny Liu, who left his job as CIO of Louis Vuitton in China to follow his passion in the blockchain industry. And working at Louis Vuitton as CIO for several years exposed Sonny Liu to all the complexities and challenges that are part of the business world. Someone like Sunny Liu who has experience in the business world that can see every nook and cranny, what's going wrong, what can be a solution to make things more efficient, how can they reduce costs, how can they improve security, uh, all all those sorts of logistics he has seen. And I think that because he's seen and identified those problems in the business world, he should be able to bring that towards providing that blockchain solution for those businesses. So he's kind of on the other side, the solution provider. So I think the fact that the CEO comes from that sort of perspective. He has helped drive the use cases of VeChain. I mean, apart from the ones I mentioned above with food safety and to counterfeiting, there's also health records, you know, that healthcare record systems can be made more efficient uh, to help record, you know, results for labs and, you know, the valuable data, the personal data can be stored on the blockchain with only patients and other authorized parties having access. So a VeChain-based EHCRT app will be rolled out to patients of both the Mediterranean Hospital of Cyprus and the Arteo Hospital in 2021. I wanted to touch upon some new news regarding this particular use case with regards to health records that the VeChain Foundation has announced that huge progress in the medical blockchain space has been seen with the Renji Hospital and DNV Assurance. So Cointelegraph has also tweeted about this and how tracking IVF progress is possible now on this blockchain. So VeChain and Renji Hospital have launched My Baby, a blockchain-based application that securely stores and tracks all aspects of the IVF process. This is great news. I I love VeChain. Can I just say I love VeChain? Who else is bullish? Please put in the comments below. Put VeChain and then put Finpact and then I will know. So yeah, guys, that's my take on VeChain. What do you guys think? And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button below and help push this video out so more people who don't normally get to see this video get to see this video. And if you haven't already subscribed, subscribe down below and put that bell notification on as I post new videos every single week and a lot of it is time sensitive information so you'll get notified when I do post a video and I also have a link down below for Webull which allows you to get two free stocks worth up to $1,600 when you deposit your first $100 so I think that's a fantastic deal check that out below I've also got links to other platforms that I do really enjoy using and thank you guys for watching bye